Hey, honey. What are you doing? Getting ready to go sailing. Going sailing? What are we doing that for? We go to the BVI and sail. Sounds like fun. Okay, let's go. Today is really a practice sail with my instructor, Jason. It's Stephanie's first sail since we started this adventure seven months ago. We'll be starting from Coquina Harbor in Little River, South Carolina, and motoring up the intercoastal waterway to Little River Inlet, and out for a day of sailing on the waters of coastal North and South Carolina. So you're on camera, honey. We're on the boat. Yeah, we're on the boat. <laughs> we're getting ready to go. <laughs> we think. We might not. And there's Jason. How's it going? He's been my instructor the whole time. So I learned everything I know about sailing from Jason. Look how pretty it is here. This is Jason's new area that he moved to, and it's absolutely gorgeous. I mean, talk about a house with a view. It's pretty cool. I just love it. We're getting ready to turn and go into the inlet waterway. Isn't this beautiful? Being here, out on the water, propelled by the wind, is a wonderful feeling. It's mid-May 2016, and our charter week in the British Virgin Islands is just a few weeks away. As I scan the horizon, breeze in my skin and in my sails, I reflect back on how it all started. Last year, sometime in late fall, I had been watching videos on YouTube. You know how that can be. You start off watching one thing, and you see a link to something interesting, so you follow it and then another, and before you know it, you're fascinated by something completely new to you. Later, I shared them with Stephanie, who found them just as fascinating. As you've likely guessed, it was videos about sailing. People from all walks of life were sharing their passion for the sea with videos about their sailing adventures. Some had sold everything they owned and set off on round-the-world journeys. Others were simply chartering a boat for a vacation. Wow, how fun we thought. How cool would that be if we could do something of the sort? We weren't talking about quitting our jobs and sailing away into the sunset, as romantic as that sounds. But what about sailing for a week in some remote tropical location? The problem was that neither of us knew the first thing about sailing, or boating of any sort for that matter. Lucky for me, I live right down the road from the Myrtle Beach Sailing School. Captain Jason Cox, owner, operator, chief instructor, made the whole process fun and easy. He expertly guided me through the ASA courses from basic keelboat sailing to bareboat cruising. As I stand at the helm today, I feel not only completely confident in my ability to skipper our upcoming bareboat charter, but elated that we will soon be joining those who have sailed before us and known the thrill of operating a boat powered by the wind.